What's going on everybody? Hope you're doing well. This is Liam from Teal and today let's talk about five ways you can use ChatGPT to prepare for a job interview. Prepping for an interview is tough and ChatGPT is a great resource for addressing some of that difficulty. So let's do it. The first thing we're going to do with ChatGPT is get some common questions that were likely to be asked in the interview. For the prompt, we want to go with what questions can I expect to be asked in a job interview for a title, position, with, company, and what skills should I highlight in my responses? Use the job description below for reference. That's the whole thing. We are going to move forward for the rest of the video with this position, so let's copy in the title and the company. This is going to give us some position-specific questions, then we want to copy the job description in and paste it below our prompt and hit run. Now, obviously, this is a social media role, and these questions are for a social media interview. Not everybody watching this is obviously going for that role. So the takeaway that we're going for here is what you want to do is read the job description, look at the responsibilities, the expectations, the qualifications, or other hard skills, and make sure that the things listed ChatGPT is giving you questions about. Those responsibilities, those qualifications, those are the things that's going to be asked about you in the interview. And the whole idea here is that you don't know exactly the type of question that you're going to get asked, so that's the results that we're getting from ChatGPT, and you just want to make sure that those questions line up with the job description. So now that we have some questions based on the job description, the next thing that we want to do is get answers to those questions. Our prompt in ChatGPT is going to be, can you help me answer some of those interview questions for the social media role at Corsair? Obviously put in the specific title and company that you're going for. And if you do this right after generating the questions from the previous section, it should use them as a reference. Otherwise, you can just copy them in manually. But let's take a look at the results. Now, like we talk a lot about with AI writing, you don't want to just use the results verbatim. This is especially true in this instance with interview question answers. Don't just use these, write them down somewhere and then like regurgitate them exactly in your interview. But what you should take away from these is kind of the structure and framework of how these answers are put together. The interviewer is going to be looking for some specific things with your answer. So any reference to like company culture, direct applicable experience in exactly what the job responsibility entails. And while you know your career skills and experience and everything there, the how to put that together in a nice answer, that's what we're looking at with these chat GPT answers. So read them through, look how they're structured and apply your own experience in this format. So now that we have some answers to interview questions, the next thing that we want to do with ChatGPT is have it give us feedback on those answers. For our prompt and continuing in the same ChatGPT thread, you want to say, can you give me feedback on my answers to your interview questions? How could I improve? When you hit go, you'll see this error that ChatGPT says, I'm not sure the questions or your answers. Can you provide them? So what you want to do is just scroll back up a bit, copy the question, add it to a new ChatGPT prompt with this like question colon intro to it. Then same thing with the answer, write answer colon, and then go up, copy the answer down below. So obviously the answers that we're using are from ChatGPT. So of course it does think it's a good response, but it does have a note of feedback for us and specifically to use specific examples in our answers. Like we talk about with resume achievements, any place where you can use metrics in your achievements is a great win. With answers to interview questions, any place where you can use a specific example in your response is a huge win. It adds validity to what you're saying. It reinforces to the interviewer the skills that you do have. And that is absolutely the type of answer that you wanna respond with in an interview. The next thing that we want to do is just get some general interview tips. For the prompt in ChatGPT, we want to say what are some high level tips for a job interview for a social media manager. Obviously, you want to use your specific title. And if you want to include the company, you absolutely can. And looking at the results, we have 10 really awesome job interview tips. Number one, know the company. Absolutely. Company research is a must for a job interview. We have some tips specifically related to our position. Number seven, prepare questions for the interviewer. That's huge. And you can also use ChatGPT for that. And what you want to do with these results, as well as honestly, the rest of the results that we been generating today, copy the results from ChatGPT and keep them somewhere safe. If we go back over to the Teal Job Tracker, we can go to the Notes tab in our position and we can just copy and paste the results from ChatGPT right here. And now whenever we revisit the job description, all of our notes for this specific position are right here, ready to go. And the next thing we're going to use ChatGPT for is just writing a quick follow-up to send to the hiring manager after the interview. Our prompt in ChatGPT is going to be write a short and conversational follow-up email to send to name regarding my interview for a title, position, with company. You are going to want to fill in those placeholder details, whether it's in the prompt or afterward, either one. And looking at the results, this is a really great starting point. Our follow-up email is short and sweet. We don't want to waste our time. It's maybe a bit wordy on the technical reiteration where we say I'm absolutely confident in our abilities. But like with all AI writing that we talk about, about. This is a starting point, so feel free to tweak this as much as you would like. But for those edits, take the results from ChatGPT, go back to your job tracker, and whatever you have in your notes, drop this follow-up email in right below it, and you want to send it out five days to a week after your initial interview. Well, thank you so much for your time today. We hope you enjoyed yourself. Drop a like on the video and subscribe to the channel for more content. And if you're not familiar with the Teal platform, check out the links below to get started. Thank you again. See you again soon.